Camilla Croso. I am currently in the Confinter Plus 6 Brazil meeting taking place in Brasilia and I am from the Latin American campaign for the right to education, CLADI. This meeting is very significant. Uh, it's important that we are taking part in it. Uh, Brazilian, the Brazilian government was also very generous to invite not only the Brazilian um, stakeholders, uh, state representatives and civil societies, but as well uh, inviting other networks from the region, which uh, represents for us an opportunity to, to engage, to also have access to the reports that we, that we currently have, that UIL have been, has been presenting, that other colleagues from the region has also been presenting. So we are, we are now discussing and debating um, the context, the shortcomings and the challenges that we have ahead. And, and also it, it's an opportunity to strategize together and have, have the chance really to, to prepare towards the Confrontea Plus 6 meeting. So CLADA has several expectations in regards to Confrontea Plus 6 meeting. Uh, one of them is that we be able to really place much more at the heart of the agenda uh, of, of education, adult education and literacy. We feel that it has always been left out in, 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 in terms of priority. It is never at the top of the priority list and there is such a huge debt towards the population, the adult population and the, young, the youth population that we, really, we feel governments really has, have to change uh, this in a, in a very dramatic way. So there has to be political will to look at adult education and learning from a different perspective and really uh, give it the necessary priority that it deserves. So this is our first expectation. We also would like to have a much more uh, participatory process, a process that really ensures that uh, it's not just really experts who are being listened to. We feel that this expert focus has to be overcome. The, the actors of the education community have to have a much more significant role in not only in the Confintea process but in all processes of policy making that relate to adult, adult, the adult and young, uh, youth population and therefore we expect the educators to be much more present, um, the learners to be much more present and really contribute in a much more significant, in a much more political way than the, these actors have so far. Another expectation that we have is that we can see more concrete um, policy changes happening after Confrontea. So we, we are not really seeing or witnessing changes that are really necessary in terms of legislation, in terms of policies and in terms of practices. Uh, so we hope that Confrontea 6 plus 6 really manages to gather the, the momentum and the political will for concrete change. And last but not least, we, we, which is actually a point that perhaps comes before the others or that is uh, that will feed into policies and legislations and into the participation of the adult community and the learners, uh, has to do with the perspective, what perspective do we really have in terms of the meaning of adult education and literacy, the meaning of lifelong education. What is it that we are understanding? Do we have a, are, are governments putting in place a more economicist approach to adult education and literacy, an instrumental approach, a human capital approach? Clady has the expectation to move away from these perspectives because policies that are actually implemented within that perspective are unhelpful from our point of view. So, what do we mean when we discuss adult education and literacy and lifelong education through a human, human rights perspective? We want to, as civil society, not just CLADI but other sister organizations, to really offer um, Confinitea Plus 6 a contribution in that direction. And, and we, re we really hope that coming out of Confinitea, we have um, a paradigm that actually informs policy making that is much more 
respectful of the actors, of the subjects of, of adult education and literacy than has been so far.